Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Jessica Wong, also known as African Lady A. Okay, okay, I'm back with another makeup tutorial on my beautiful client slash best friend. Okay, for her birthday, we came up with this look. First off, let me go ahead and say if you're new to my channel, please go ahead and click that subscribe button and also that bell button so you get notifications whenever I drop a new tutorial, okay? And for my returning subscribers, I just want to say thank you guys for coming back and thank you for your love and support. All right, let's get into this look. So today we're going for a golden um, halo, uh, golden goddess type look. She had a photo shoot that she was doing. So this was the look that I was able to come up with. And literally this this look i just i fell in love with it guys and i thought i should share with you guys on how you guys can be able to recreate this look as well all right guys i just went in with my revolution um fixed in glow spray and then i went in with my concealer from essence all right guys and i just went ahead and concealed her eyebrows as i usually do and also primed the lid and now I'm taking my foundation from Maybelline. I'm using the shade Mocha. And I'm just going in and applying this with my little concealer brush. Um, so I have like better control over where, you know, product is going. And also this, I'm able to um, prevent my brush from getting too soaked up and eat up all my foundation. So this process helps a little bit with that. And I'm just pressing this into her skin as you guys can see me do and yeah that's all I'm doing I'm just pressing it in pressing 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 all right here we go and excuse my hair guys I'm going through like the locking phase where it's just like crazy okay like it's literally crazy now I'm taking my Revolution um, Concealer. I'm using the C13, I believe it is. And I'm just taking that to conceal um, everywhere that I need for her face to stand out. And her nose, forehead, underneath the eyes, chin, and cupid's bow. And that's all I'm doing. I'm just applying that concealer in shade C13. Okay, guys? And please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up if you guys are loving this look and drop your comments be below on your thoughts about this look. And please don't forget to follow your girl on social media and you know my names are on the screen guys. Alright I'm just going in and blending that into the skin using the patting motion uh, with my concealer brush and I'm just pressing that in as you guys can see me do. I'm just patting, trying to um, make get rid of all the lines and just blend everything in. Okay. All right. Now I'm going in with my um, Black Radiance uh, Foundation Stick in Expresso, and I'm just using that to contour the face. All right, I'm just contouring and applying where I want to create shadows. And yeah. And I'm just going in and contouring the nose as well. This video has been long overdue. My birthday was in December 27. Okay, guys. Yeah, I just had like a lot of stuff going on, but I'm happy to be able to um, do this. It's just been taking me forever to do this voiceover because I wanted to edit the video and then, you know, going with the voiceover. But yeah, I'm just blending that in with my foundation brush. Um, just trying to blend the concealer. No, not the concealer. The contour. Okay. I'm just patting that into the skin.
For right now, I'm just going in and setting underneath the eyes with my Black Radiance um, setting powder. And I'm just pressing that in. And then now I'm going in with my setting powder from Sasha, I believe. Yeah, I'm just baking with Sasha and then I went in with the setting powder from Black Radiance. Alright, so that's all I'm doing. Alright, now it's time for us to do the eyeshadow. I'm priming her eyelids with my e.l.f. Um, uh, what you call it? Concealer? The, um, the matte concealer. And now I'm going with my Zulu palette. And I'm going to be taking this burnt, this orange, burnt orange and yellow shade. And I'm using that on the crease to create the shadows and stuff. I'm using those three colors to create the look that I want. Um, I'm using that as transition colors and I'm just blending it with my blending, small blending brush. I was using the yellow at first, now I'm going with the orange, obviously. And I'm just patting that in. Alright, I'm just bringing it in. Now I'm taking my Warrior 2 palette and I'm going to be using that shade right there and I'm just going ahead and applying that again on top of the orange and I'm creating more shadows. Okay, I'm just blending with my blending brush, creating shadows and, you know, I'm just going in and just packing that color in. It's getting darker and darker, but you can still see the orange, you can still see the yellow and everything, so... I'm going back in and applying that orange and that yellow as well just to make them stand out a little bit and I'm just taking a step back to see you know what I like what I, what needs to be added and stuff like that so I'm going back in and adding all that in there and I'm just blending all right and we're getting getting there and I'm taking my Sahara 2 palette and I'm using that shade right here and I'm just gonna go in and just apply that to the center of the eye. This is like one of my favorite gold shades in the, in the palette. The Sahara has like a really pretty gold shade. And I'm just going back in with that, um, with the other colors and just applying that just to blend everything together. As you guys can see, I'm just darkening it up. And now I'm taking this gold glitter and I'm just applying that to the center of the eye just to add some sparkle like you guys can see 
Just adding a little bit of sparkle glitter, you know, that's the trick. And just pressing that in with a small flat brush. Now I'm taking this JLRU um, white gold pigment and I'm just going and applying that on top of the um, glitter just to add a little bit more um, sparkle, okay? You never go wrong. You never have enough sparkle. Now I'm taking my Wet n Wild um, wing liner, liquid liner, and I'm just going in and creating the wing. And I'm going for somewhat of a cat eye wing liner. And I'm just blending that on the corners. First off, I was gonna do, I was not gonna do like a full wing. That's why you see me blending that out. But later on, um, I did go in and create a full wing. So you gotta just give me a minute, okay? You get to see that part where I, I changed it up. I changed my mind and I went in and, you know, did a, a full wing. Because she wanted a full wing. So we did a full wing, okay? And I'm just creating the cat effect in the corners of the eye. Now I'm going in with my Black Radiant Setting Powder. And I'm just using this to blend in everything, the setting powder that we did use earlier. And I'm just trying to get rid of all those. Now I'm going back in and adding a little bit of um, black to the corners of the eyes, just to intensify that. Her back was itching so I was helping her out. <laughs> Don't mind us guys. <laughs> Now I'm taking my glow, um, this is called contour thing from Revolution and I'm just using that as, to contour and bronze her, her face. That's all I'm doing and I'm jamming, dancing and I'm just patting that in and creating a shadow. I'm going in with a blush palette and I'm using that shade right there just to warm up her face and blush it up, okay? That's all I'm doing. Now I'm just going in and I'm lining her waterline and I'm connecting the um, line that we did earlier for the cat eye. And then now I'm going in and doing a full wing, okay guys? So I'm just taking that same Wet n Wild um, liquid liner and I'm just going in and creating that wing. Okay, okay, do you see that? I love this wing. It came out so good. I love it. All right guys, and that's the wing. And I'm just going in and adding a little bit of that pigment just to blend everything out. And now I'm going in with my um, Tuvia's highlight in Nubia and I'm just highlighting her cheeks. And there we go, just blending that in. We're having a weird conversation, I don't remember, but <laughs> her <own> face. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna highlight her cupid's bow, her chin and her cheeks, her nose. There we go. And now I'm going in and doing her lips. I'm just taking um like a chocolate brown um lip lipstick, lip gloss situation, glossy lipstick. And I'm just going in and carving out, like just lining her lips with that. Now I'm going in with my black radiance um lipstick nude lipstick and i'm just putting that in the center of the lip now i'm going with my clear gloss and i'm just taking that and applying it on the lip just to um glossify it because i love i love me some glossy lips if you guys like glossy lips leave a comment down below 
like I'm a, I'm a glossy girl okay and this is the finished look I'm just going back in and applying a little bit more highlight just to bring it out a little bit more and I'm just just blending stuff out to be honest so I'm just going back in and just blending what needs to be blended um, adding what needs to be added you know she's feeling herself okay <laughs> and this is the final look guys i hope you guys are able to learn from this and i hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial she was feeling herself i was feeling this look too and everything like it was just it was it's just beautiful okay guys let me know what you guys think in the comment section and what you guys would like to see on my channel next and this is the before okay y'all see that magic and yes this is a before beautiful before and Woo! and this after okay look at that beautiful i hope you guys have a great 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 week and thank you guys so much for watching god bless you guys remember to stay black and beautiful bye bye Mwah.